This machine can peel over 100 pineapples a minute. We see it at work today. On the go! Checkers and Pogo, on the go! This giant pineapple water tank has become one of Honolulu's famous landmarks. And it marks where we're going today, the Dole Pineapple Cannery. Right, Pogue. Hey, and our tour is going to begin right here in the fruit receiving yards. Wow, we look at all those pineapples. You know, they handle over 360 million pineapples each year. Oh, gee whiz. And each one of those bins holds about seven tons of pineapple. And they unload the fruit directly into an automatic grater. There, the pineapple is separated by size and drops into a huge water flume. Then it's washed. Carefully rinsed with fresh water and elevated into the cannery on a conveyor system. The Dole plant is the world's largest fruit cannery. Each pineapple passes through the processing system in about 15 minutes. And all fruit is canned in 24 hours or less after it's picked. Wow, but you know, that's really efficient. Hey, why is that man watching television, Mr. Checkers? Shouldn't he be working? He is working, Pogue. He's directing the action there in the control room of the conveyor belts. He's watching part of the operation on the television screen. What, what, what kind of machines are those, Mr. Checkers? Huh? Oh, those are Janaka machines, Pogue. It was named after Henry Janaka, the engineer who invented it. The Janaka machine is one of the most important things in the whole cannery. Gee, what does it do, Mr. Checker? Well, it removes the shell from the pineapple, cuts off both ends of the fruit, punches out the core, and leaves each fruit a golden cylinder. The Janaka machine can handle about 100 fruit a minute. Wow, that, that's really amazing, Mr. Checkers. Oh, and after the Janaka machine has done its work, the pineapple cylinders go to the trimming tables at the rate of 50 to 100 every minute. All these women in white caps, aprons, and rubber gloves pick up each cylinder individually. They trim away the eyes, bits of shell, or overripe portions left on the fruit. And what happens next, Mr. Checkers? Well, then the cylinders are mechanically sliced, packers grade and place the slices in cans. In addition to sliced pineapple, the cannery packs pineapple chunks, tidbits, cubes, juice, and crushed pineapple. Who's that, Pope? Oh, that's the inspector who checks the quality of the pineapple being canned. What do you mean? Well, she takes the pineapple out of the can, checks the slices, and then tests to see if the slices are the right size. Now, these inspectors are very highly trained, Mr. Checkers, and they constantly check the work going on at the various tables to make sure the top quality standards are maintained. Mm. Sure is a busy place, isn't it, Jack? You know it. Busiest I've ever seen in my whole life. And what's those machines there doing? Well, well, they're filling the cans with juice or syrup. Then they go through a vacuum seamer where the covers are attached and the cans are sealed. Oh, I see. And next they go to the cookers where they are sterilized and heated for 5 to 15 minutes, depending on the size of the can and of the product. And after cooling, the cans are placed in pallets and stored in warehouses to be labeled at a later time. Oh, sure is something, isn't it? You know, I just thought of something, Mr. Checkers. What's that? Pineapple that was picked yesterday, or even this morning, maybe even from another island, goes through this cannery and is ready for the grocer's shelf. Maybe even that same afternoon. That's right. Oh, boy, I'm going to go get mine now. Bye! But, 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 well, I guess we're on the go! Mm -hmm.